This is not financial advice, not legal advice, for entertainment, educational purposes only, and anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff so you get advantage I put them out. See what I'm thinking, see I'm analyzing that data. But like I tell every day, the day they release us is false. I'm going to give us a false narrative of the market so we can make bad trading decisions. Listen, Neo and BYD have been approved to do autonomous level three and level four testing in China. And these are the first two companies to be given this authority. I mean, it is absolutely crazy. In my opinion, I believe it's a positive catalyst. I'm not telling you to buy NEO. I'm not telling you to buy BYD. But I think these companies are about to run. And you guys all know that BYD biggest individual shareholder is Warren Buffett. Okay, so that 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 should tell you a lot right there. But here's the thing. NEO is just, they, they just delivering vehicles over 20,000 in May, breaking their own record. And they're on pace to break that record in June of 2024. And there are rumors, there are rumors that NEO has the workers doing double shifts because the demand for their vehicles is outpacing the supply. I mean, that is absolutely crazy. And I'm not telling you to buy, hold, or sell NEO. I'm not telling you to buy, hold, or sell BYD. But when you get approval for autonomous driving for the first time in the history of China, when you're delivering more vehicles than you anticipated, when you have to have the workers working double shifts in order to meet the demand for your vehicles, I believe that is a positive catalyst. I believe that NEO is going to take over the European market. That's what I see. And once again, I'm not telling you to buy, hold, or sell NEO. I just see them being a big dog in the EV industry. And if these guys build that factory in Mexico, a lot of American EV companies are going to be in trouble because then they could just drive those cars over the Mexican-American border for free without any tariffs. And that's going to be quality EV vehicles in the United States at very reduced prices. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think that NEO and BYD getting approved to do autonomous L3 and L4 driving in China is a positive catalyst that could get the stocks to run. Anyway, have a great day. God bless. And I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.